the peaceful Apache life, courtship and romance were a part of the order of things. But when marriage plans were made for Chiwaki and Luesa, no one could foresee the chain of circumstances which would lead to murder. Well, Mr. Jeffers, I've been looking forward to this moment. I received a telegram from Colonel McBride at Fort Boy asking that I give all the help possible. I'm greatly indebted to that fine gentleman. How is the Colonel? Same as ever. Tis me gouty joint, laddie. Telegram mentioned a Congress of Indians to be held in San Francisco. And my dream comes true. Mr. Jeffers. The chasm of ignorance separates my San Francisco from your Indian country. All they know are the stories of murdering, scouting savages. And an Apache? Why, they claim there's even fire in the name. Now, I want people of San Francisco to get a true picture of the American Indian. And my Congress couldn't be complete without an Apache. I'll talk to Cochise. I'm greatly indebted to you. I saw an Apache as I was riding in uh, by a pool just a few miles out. A powerful, handsome lad. He was with the most beautiful Indian girl I have ever seen. You must mean Chiwaki and Luwatha. is thrown into the pool. When none are left, they'll be married. <laughs> More of a game than ceremonial custom. Wait, it would be hurt if Chiwaki didn't try and cheat. How long will he be in San Francisco if he agrees to go? Well, oh, not over two weeks, I should say. Chiwaki? It is our friend and brother. Dominic's Museum, ladies and gentlemen, the sensation of the Barbary Coast, a gay stimulation for the mind. Let the facts astound the imagination. Hold it, driver. And for your entertainment, ladies and gentlemen, at great personal expense, we have gathered the freak sonorities of the world. This is Sinbad, ladies and gentlemen, the Sultan's watch charm, the pride and joy of the harem. I have never seen such a small man. And also on the inside, ladies and gentlemen, you're going to see Dorothy Dolphin, the skeleton of a mermaid, half woman and half fish. Half woman and half fish? And may I call your attention, ladies and gentlemen, to the horrible and cruel face of Bonovac, the wild man of Borneo. Is he really a wild man? He will be tomorrow. All right, Clarence. <laughs> Turn it passed. I'd had no word of any kind. So I went to Fort Boyd to ask Colonel McBride about the Indian conquerors in San Francisco. But he had never heard of the Mr. Doherty I described and denied ever sending me a telegram. My sympathy, laddie. And I'd be taking myself to Frisco and finding out what's going on. 
with the curiosity of the devil himself. How could this man be knowing so much of my personal life and affliction? You're quite a public figure, Colonel. I'll keep you posted. Forgive me not showing you the door. <laughs> Tis my gouty joints, laddie. Hey. I'll find my way out. Hurry, 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 buy your tickets. The whole town is talking about Chief Red Bull. He's on the inside, the scourge of the plains, the Apache madman. See this fiendish monster with your own eyes. All right, ladies and gentlemen, hurry, hurry, buy your tickets. The gentleman is over there waiting for you. See this street that you shall never forget. It is not true. I am Chiwachi. I have never killed a white man or an Indian. You're a sneaking lion Indian. I had a cousin who was killed crossing the plains. Maybe you're the murderer that got him. <laughs> but can't we do something about it? Take it easy. Just put a fortune in our pocket. Can't you stop him shouting he's innocent all the time? Why? Was there ever a guilty man that didn't claim innocence? It starts a ruckus. People get mad. They, they talk back. But if you could just tone him down. It is not true. You bring the people I in. White I'll Indian. take care of the Indians. I am Kiwaki. I slipped you something from the kitchen. It's got beef. You like it. Hurry up, we sees you. We both be in trouble. It's not easy being an engine. Or midget either. Of course, I know you're not a bad engine. Just like I've never been in a hero. But we've got to make the best of our lives. Try to put the war paint on you. Do the shows like they want you, and they'd get treated better. No. Chiwaki will speak loud. And fight if he has to. But that don't do no good. People who pay to look at you won't act so mean and argue that you're a real bad engine. <laughs> Red Bull, you, you ain't really a bad engine. Your keys, little one. San Francisco and asked the police to help me find Chiwaki and a man who called himself Doherty. The name Apache led me to a Dominic's museum. 
although it seemed impossible that the savage described in the papers could be Chewaukee. Ladies and gentlemen, there were skeptics among you who claimed that Chief Red Bull was a hoax and not really a murdering savage. But now that my good friend and partner has laid down his life in mute testimony to prove that there never has been or will be a fraud here in Dominic's museum. So, ladies and gentlemen, see the scene of the crime, the very cage from which this murdering scout and engine escaped. All right, now, hurry, hurry, buy your tickets. The gentleman is waiting for you right over there. Come right over, mister, take the lady with you. See the exact scene of the crime, what happened to my partner. Buy your tickets. The gentleman is waiting for us. Come right over there, mister. See the actual cage where my partner was killed. Yes, sir. That's the way Chief Red Bull escaped, Inspector. Oh, Mr. Jeffrey. I'm Inspector Higgins. We met at the police station. You were looking for a friend of yours. That's right. An Apache named Chiwaki. I have a report that he arrived on the stagecoach, but nothing beyond that. Well, when I get this murder off my hands, I'll help you look for your Indian friend. Thanks, Inspector. Can I talk to you for a jiffy? Pretend you're looking at me curious. Are you really a friend of Chewaukee's? Of course. He's in terrible trouble. Why? He's Chief Red Bull. And you know about him murdering a man. Chewaukee just wanted to be free. A man had a whip and a gun. Was going to shoot him. He's in terrible trouble. Now everybody will think he's a murdering engine. Likely headed for the Sierras to hide out. Finding him will be a job. Well, I wish you luck. So where'd you find this Indian, this Chief Red Bull? Well, what do you mean? I mean, how'd you get him for the museum? Well, he just drifted in here looking for a job. But how did I know it was going to be a bad engine? Oh, I see. So please treat this confidentially, Inspector. It's bad for business, you understand. And, uh, business is good, huh? Please, do what you can to help you walking. Thanks. Mr. Jeffries. Yes, Inspector? Is it possible your friend Chewaukee and this Chief Red Bull are the same man? Chewaukee's a fine warrior, Mr. Higgins, but he's not a killer. denied that the murdered man in the museum had been scalped. Who are this being, boys? Chief Red Bull ain't ten miles from here. Go get him!
morning, stranger. I'm Inspector Higgins, San Francisco Police. Trailing that murder in Savage, huh? Indirectly, yes. Seen anything of a young fellow riding a sorrel, light hat, fancy leather jacket? Yeah, right after the posse took off. Oh, not more than a half hour ago. Headed south. Bet you don't get your engine back to Frisco. He'll get lynched. Except Haynes too good for him. <laughs> telegraph wires here and I had an advantage over any posse I could think like an Apache and have a pretty good guess at which direction she walkie would take Chewaukee. Come closer. I want to see your face when you speak. Don't you know me, Chewaukee? Listen to me. I'm Chief Red Bull. No, that was only a name in a white man's city. And who sent me to the white man's city? Chewaukee, listen. I'm Jefford, your friend. I'll take you to Cochise. destroyed one of your people, Cochise. Light has gone out of his eyes like a fine horse that has been whipped and broken. He had plenty of spirit for a while. He even held a knife in my throat. He has no anger for you now. He did let me lead the way. You asked for me, Cochise? Look. Chiwaki! Chiwaki! Louisa? Louisa? I think the little one is the medicine to make him well. Walker is killed. What will happen when you take him back with you? I'm not going to, Cochise. In California, they call him the most hated savage that ever lived. They'd never give him a fair trial. 
I have never heard you speak this way. I thought I'd look you up. Say, uh, did you ever find that friend of yours? Um, Shiwaki, I think his name was. But not in San Francisco. He was this side of the Sierras. I'm, uh, I'm kind of curious. I'd like to meet him. Did you ever find that savage, uh, Chief Red Bull, I think his name was? Not yet. No, I wonder whether it really was murder. A self-defense and a man's right to be free. Sitting on a jury isn't my job, Mr. Jeffers. Let's go meet your friend. be married in a few days. They'd be married now, except for the man who took Chiwaki away. They're building their wiki up. Louisa wants it larger, but Chiwaki says that relatives will move in with them. I got a lot of relatives in a big home. Funny thing, I always thought Chewaki and Chief Red Bull were the same man. But that's no murder and savage. Tell that by looking at him. Catching Red Bull had been a big feather in my cap, but I'm glad it didn't turn out that way. It's been a pleasure sitting on the jury with you, Mr. Jeffers. <laughs> 